we got uh, Josh Moore back in the building. He was here for 11 years as your assistant. Um, I know a lot of people don't like to say that, uh, ah, it's just another duel, but this, that, I think that puts a little more into this rivalry with Cleveland State. Well, you know, I, I think it's Cleveland State, and you always want to beat Cleveland State. They're right down the road. We recruit a lot of the same kids, and he's doing a great job over there, and, yeah, you want to beat him. I, th I think at this point we want to beat anyone we can at this point. So, we're, we're, you know, we're doing as much as we can to put our guys in a position to win a match. You guys are trying, you're trying to avoid the assistant sweep. I am trying to avoid this. <laughs> Would you agree with that? Yeah, yeah, hundred percent. Like I said, we're like, yeah, yes. I'm trying to avoid the assistant sweeps now. <laughs> because well, Matt Hill beat you yeah, earlier. Yeah, yeah 100%. I don't know if they could beat you right now. I talked to Matt yeah the other day, and uh, we're better than we were at the beginning of the year. There's no doubt about it. We were a team that's gotten better. It's just it's taken us time, and we're really inconsistent, especially at home. We've wrestled probably worse at home than we have any any other place. Um, so, like I said, I'm hoping that we can come out and wrestle well. I'm hoping for, uh, you know, one of our last, or actually our last home duel of the year, that our guys can come out and compete. You know, you look at your duels, you know, you were great in Virginia. You, had, you were yeah. two and two there. You took fourth. Yep. Virginia duels, you beat Penn. You beat some teams. It was yep. actually pretty impressive. And, and you liked... Wrestled Fresno State to a one-point match, 15-16. Yeah. to 16. Yeah. UVA, you wrestled tough, yeah, you right? Won four matches yeah. against them. Yeah, and then, you know, you were really tough. You beat Penn. Yeah. You beat a Big Ten team, Maryland. So, you know, you were right there. And then next week, you kind of you get a lot down in the grudge match with OU. They horrible, really, and yeah. they beat you up. They, they, they wrestled hard. They wrestled hard on our guys. They, they came out here and they won. They, they, they wrestled harder than we did, 100%. Joel when, did a great job of getting them ready. When you look at some of those ones where they were kind of abusing your guys, like physically. What, I don't, how, I don't how, know if they really – they, they were just – some of our guys, they, they came out and they, they controlled the match and they set the pace and they, they, they beat our guys. Yeah, I don't know if they, they didn't beat them up. Our guys weren't bloody and anything like that. They 165, Cade got head-butted in head the face and, and pinned, run yeah. over. The guy that was over. abusive. All right, well, all right, maybe. You give me that one? I, I, I don't know. I just watched it as a wrestling match. A guy did a double leg, knocked him over and pinned him. My guy just took it, you know, so, yeah. How do you fix those things? How do you fight harder in Cleveland State tonight? I think I think in, you have to do the things the right way all the way th during the week, and you have to get better at things. And Kate doesn't cut his weight right th all the time, and he showed it in the match. He was one of the I think, second or third matchup because we started at 49, if I remember. And he just he's a guy that cuts a lot of weight and didn't do it right that week. Hopefully this week he did it right, and he's going to be last this time around. So hopefully that's an example. But, uh, yeah. Huge swing match, 84. Huge. Oh, you're right. We went to, went to Buffalo. We beat Buffalo. Oh, I was, go, I was going there. I was going to go there. I was going to go there. So, so you know, you, okay, yeah. So it's real weird. It's peaks yeah. and valleys, right? Yeah. You knock yeah. Buffalo off. Buffalo beat West Virginia. They beat Edinburgh. And they're really, but hold on. Buffalo is the toughest team to wrestle in a one-hour weigh-in. Yep. Because they cut weight real hard, and then they wrestle even harder. Yep. Their guys can and you, I don't know if you've ever beaten John as, as, a, as a Buffalo coach. Yeah, two years. One year. One year you'd beat him, I think. Well, he's only been there three years. Been no, years five. Ago. I beat him. First two years, I beat him. You beat him? Yeah. Okay, but no, he's... Been, we had a real bad team two years ago, or three years ago we lost last year. Two years ago we beat him, then last year we lost to him. Okay. So he's he's on a, he's got a win streak against you, and you knocked them off, <laughs> yeah. right? You got a big win at 33 there, right? Yeah. Yep. Tim I'm Rooney not... tonight, he's got a swing match against a Buffalo transfer, yep. right? Yep. What what do you need out of guys like Tim Rooney tonight? Well, I, there's a few guys that we need, to, we need to go out and score points. Like I said, you, you, as coaches, you, you try to figure out the, you know, who needs to do what, and Tim's one of the guys we need to come out and score a lot of points. And when, when Tim can wrestle, when Tim goes out there and, and, and just wrestles and lets it out, he can score as many points, and he has so many different things he can do. So he's one of those guys that we need him to score points. 184, you got a fifth-year senior against a true freshman. Yep. Um, that's a match you're absolutely expecting to win, but it's a swing match. 97, same thing, another swing match. We, well, 97, we beat him earlier in the year, so we're hoping that we can beat him again this year. Um, 84, like I said, you might call us a, 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 we're favored. I, I call it a swing. I think it's a it's a it's a toss up match. We haven't had very whole lot of success at 84. Um, I don't know if we won a, a match at 184 in a dual meet yet this year. Really, if you if you think about it, so that's a match that you know we're hoping we can come out and we can steal. We can steal that one. Yeah, hundred percent. Got to avoid that assistant sweep. You got anything else for me, coach? No, man. No, we're as a program. We we, we got a lot of really good freshmen. We're getting better. Um, like I said last year, we we had five. Season-ending injuries. Four of those guys didn't come back that we expected to be on our team this year. One guy is on Penn State. Well, team. he's no longer with right? them, but that's a guy yeah. that we expected to get a fifth year. Barrario, which was our starting one, sixty-five pounder, two years ago, he, uh, he he took third in the conference, lost to a, a guy who went to national national in overtime. Um, Monaco, who was ranked as low as twelfth in the country as a true freshman, um, so right there's and then our heavyweight uh, that left last year blew out his ACL. He didn't come back. And those are guys that were way better than the guys we have in our lineup right now. So we're just trying to replace them still. And like I said, replacing kids now nowadays is not the easiest thing. But we had last year we had a really solid team going into the year. That's why I scheduled Wisconsin and Iowa and, and Penn State and had the team we had. Like I said, it was the first time in my career that I'd lost one person to a season-ending injury. 
I also lost I lost five guys this season in the injuries last year. So it was just, and now we're trying to recover still. So we're working really hard to try to do it. It just takes time. All right, I'm ready for a dog fight tonight. You got anything else for me? I think it'd be an exciting match. Like I said, I'm, I'm excited for it. I'm, I'm hoping hoping our guys are ready to wrestle. Um, last home match of the year against a rival, against most of these guys know Josh too. They they either recruited him or he was here for at the very end of their time. So, you know, hopefully our guys are ready to go. And the other thing is it's senior night. So hopefully they can come out and they can perform. And hopefully it'll be a good, good crowd too. All right, coach, good luck. Hey, thank you.